everybody doing? Welcome to another amazing episode of our Mentorship Sunday. Today is such a beautiful day and such a wonderful day. You guys here at 161. So today's video is going to be extremely powerful just because a lot of people, I did a Q&A and a lot of people gave me a lot of common answers as to what they would like to see in these videos. So I'm deciding to go ahead and listen to you guys. So today we're going to talk about how to stay positive through difficult situations and number one is you know it all starts with you guys staying positive is something that needs to happen naturally and the more you practice that the more it's gonna become a reality so just remember there are too many good things in this world to dwell on the bad ones so once you once you start dwelling on those bad things they become your life right and you cannot allow that to happen you gotta have control over yourself. You can't be relying on things, extern, external things that don't give you the fulfillment and the happiness that you deserve. So first understand what is it that you want? What is it that makes you happy? Be unapologetic about that. Be proud of that. Embrace that. Because I can promise you at the end of the day, that's what's gonna make you happier. No matter what people say, no matter what people show you, no matter who shows their true colors, if you do what you want to do, at the end of the day, you're going to be happy, you know? So I think that's one of the most important things you guys should understand about this today. I think that you guys, every single one of, goes my baby. of you have the potential to do what you have to do. Every single one of you has the drive to do what you have to do. All it takes is a little bit of execution, right? And once you apply that execution, everything else just comes falling into place. So remember, once you're feeling like you're in a negative place, pray, meditate, read the Bible, read a book, right? Because these are the things that are gonna help you. These are the things that are gonna, these are the things that are gonna expand your mindset. And these are the things that are in the long run gonna be beneficial for you your health and for everybody that loves you so guys always remember that you are what matters most you are what matters most that's the that's the best way i can put it um always 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 seek something physical exercise do something to get you active it's getting colder now so you have to you have to be aware of that you know you have to be mindful you know, it's easy to curl up. Don't allow yourself to curl up. Do nothing and let this season pass because a new season offers you new opportunities. New opportunities could give you potential new profits, new blessings, but that's only if you take them, right? It's only gonna happen if you take them and if you execute. So we gotta take them, we gotta execute, and we can do this together, guys. I wanna help every single one of you achieve your goals. I want every single one of you to become the best version of yourself because only like that will you be able to experience the true happiness of life. Only like that will you be able to experience what life really has to offer. So a lot of things are very, very temporary. A lot of things, they, they don't really matter. But you, you know, you're not temporary. You matter. And as long as you guys keep that strong mentality, everything is going to work out for the best. Guys, today wasn't really a long video, but I felt it in my heart just to tell you guys that. I want to say I love you guys. God bless you guys. I'm going to be dropping the biblical text uh, in the next slide. And I just want every single one of you to become the best version of yourselves. Because that's one of the most important things you can achieve as a human being, as an individual. And listen, let me tell you something. The best version of yourself is going to vary from time to time when you're feeling sick as opposed to when you're feeling healthy. So just take advantage of the feeling, right? Remember how you feel. Take advantage of that and execute on that, guys, because every single one of you has so much potential. You don't even know. So do that, guys. Do that this week. I challenge you guys to impact five people's lives this week in a positive way. And I know every single one of you can. Share this video, share with your friends, the people that you love, somebody that needs this, because it's not about, you know, it's about the message getting across to those individuals. So take care of yourselves, guys. Take care of your souls. 
and I'll see you guys next week for our mentorship Sunday. Take care. And pray in the spirit on all occasions with all kinds of prayers and requests. With this in mind, be alert and always keep on praying for all the Lord's people. Ephesians chapter 6 verse 18. Thank you.